Good morning. Please open your texts. Let me tell you a little bit more about James. James was at one with Paul. They were in agreement. Uh, they both believed that the new faith, this faith, was to move beyond Jews and on to the Gentiles. They were not sticklers for the law, that the, the Gentiles did not have to follow Jewish law. They were in agreement. We're going to talk about faith and deeds today. Sometimes I think we could all run for judgeships in the next election. Why? Because it seems like we're very good at judging others. But what would it look like if we fulfilled others and loved them in spite of the trials that we're going through and in spite of the trials that they might be going through? What if we helped the addicted and afflicted? The pro and the con and the ex-con. Surely if we have the sensibilities to judge others and the sense to know what is best, we could use that brain power that God's given us and our energy and our particular talents to fulfill the shortcomings in others instead of judging them. So what we're going to look at in week two, first, do not judge but love. Ch James chapter 2 verses 1 through 13 and 48. Point number two, faith outflows deeds. Doesn't supersede it, not one greater than the other. It's natural outflow, James 2, 14 through 17. And finally, we're judged by our actions. Yep, yeah, we're judged by actions. James chapter 2, verses 18 through 26. Have a blessed week.